Hi Pisces, welcome to your reading. How are you? In this reading I will be looking at your current energies, the person in your mind, the next new person coming in if you're looking for a new connection, and other important details. If you're new to the channel, welcome as well, and I invite you to subscribe because I post daily. Also, if you have any feedback or suggestions, you can write me at the feedback link that is in the description box. Okay, let's start. And first let's shuffle four times the deck. And let's see what we have here. I saw the Knight of Cups. So somebody wants to talk. I think there's a new potential here. A prince or princess charming coming your way. With some compliments. But let's see. Let's get the details of this reading. This is for November. Or the remaining days of November. What are the energies around you? You want to work on this, the other person is very upset, or vice versa. And uh, yes, there are deep-seated bitterness as feelings, being very, very upset with each other, I think. One of you is trying to defocus by trying to put that uh, connection as a distraction now, and just trying to focus in the work and career. There's strong determination to just focus on <clears throat> on something that brings more security, like work, where it can be much more predictable than this connection that might have been very unstable. There's still confusion, not, not some clarity here, and there's no movement, no progress. Now let's see about what is affecting you in your subconscious that you might not be aware of. The feelings are there. The feelings are still there in the subconscious. There's something that you might not be aware of, but I do believe you developed some deep feelings for this person. Now, what was the main challenge in the past? I think uh, you acted in a very naive way. You were accepting some behavior that should not be given another chance. You took a leap of faith many times with this situation. You trusted too much. Even though you had evidence that things were not going in the right direction. Your focus is to manifest the connection of your dreams. You want to be with somebody that chases you, claims you, wants to be with you, shows affection with words and with actions especially. And you have this fear that the situation with the per person that is in your mind might have ended already. It is, it is over. And you are just wasting energy and time there. Now let's see about this person that is currently in your mind. Let's see what are their current energies towards the situation with you. Let's see the first card. Ace of Pentacles. They know that with you they can build something serious, solid. But they are very upset with you as well and they are taking a very logical approach. They are not very in contact with their feelings for you. They want to tell you some truths. They want to tell you an honest opinion about something. Let's see, what is that? that they were confused before and they acted very detached with you and maybe rushed the decision to cut off the connect connection completely. This person has been thinking and still thinks about is it worth starting something serious with this connection, restarting this or not. Now they see you cold as well and they imagine approaching you with a message, with an attempt to restart this or talk about this, but uh, they see you ignoring them. They see you postponing, replying to their message or just saying no, like a complete rejection. What is on their mind, mostly right now? That they should be patient. They should not rush anything. 
they should heal completely from this. Yes, they have been resisting. Uh, they haven't given up, but they are still in this energy of trying to give up. Do they plan any actions in the near future? I don't think so. They are healing. And as we saw with the temperance, they are trying to be not rushed towards a decision to communicate. They think it has ended in the worst way possible. It's over. It's not easy. It hurts a lot still. Will they take any actions in the near future? They will stay firm. And uh, I don't think they. it will be very easy for them to change their mind. They will resist to talk. They will resist to communicate. Let's see what is some possible energy till the end of this year regarding the situation. Six of Wands, you will have lots of attention from others. But at the same time, one of you might give some signs of interest. I think there might be a comeback or some kind of communication, reunion. But it's not happening, apparently, this November. Probably in December or early January 2025. You will talk. But it will not happen soon. That's the kind of message that I'm getting. Now, if you want to know even more details about this person that is currently in your mind, with more details about their current energies, uh, there's an extended video in the description box below with even more details about their current energies and I will see some more of your energies as well if you are interested. Now let's jump to the next story, the new person. If you're looking for a new connection, a new person, let's see what is the overall energy of the next new person coming in. It will start as a friendship. Uh, this might be your friend already. And uh, none of you will think this will take off and be something long-term as a relationship, if it starts like that. Might be your friend, your current friend, or it starts as a friendship. I have Earth signs here, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Let's see what will be their first impression about you. Too much reflective, withdrawn, needing alone time. introverted what will be your first impression like they don't have much feelings or it's very difficult for them to open up emotionally that will be that will be their first impression about you now let's see what is the energy the first month of the interaction the i see you quite attached to each other there might happen something where you both will have to rethink about the future of this, but already you are attached emo emotionally and it will not be easy to to give up on this. So there might be a, a split or a mini breakup here, but the energy will be there very strong. Even though you might be apart, you will be together energetically. And uh, the first month, the interaction seems very mutual, a give and take, balanced, harmonious. But why will you both not be quite confident or why, why that split or breakup might happen? It is because one of you becomes too attached and uh, clingy and uh, it becomes like too much and one of you needs some distance or this overwhelming and the other person needs it step by step it might be uh, reversed but as an energy but that's what i'm getting so becoming emotionally independent is very important with the situation as well as uh, as we saw might be an earth sign here uh, there's scorpio as well virgo is emphasized and as i said overall Earth signs in general towards Capricorn Virgo, or they have uh, a strong focus of planets placements in their birth chart in an Earth sign, like Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. 
Pi says this was your general reading. If you uh, liked and resonated with this reading, please hit the like button and share the video. If you want to, it helps the channel a lot and I highly appreciate it. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, I invite you to subscribe. Because I post daily, you can check the schedule of the readings in the description box below this video. Thank you for watching, wishing you all the best and I will see you in the next reading. Bye for now.